Kellogg here from Boardwalk Hall. It's got to be nice to be back here, right? Uh, it feels good uh, to come back to a place that, you know, we, we scheduled the Legends Classic earlier in the year so that we'd have an opportunity to play here, and hopefully it'll give our guys a little bit of an advantage, the, the comfort of the building, the, uh, the, the times that we've shot in these hoops. So um, I'm hoping that the familiarity with Atlantic City and also Boardwalk Hall will give us a little bit of an itch. The last time we saw your face smiling here on this website, it was Tuesday night after Charlotte. Let's fill everybody watching in on what you've done since Tuesday night. Well, on Wednesday morning, we had a nice late breakfast. We jumped on a charter plane, came right down to Atlantic City, had an easy day on Wednesday, took the rest of the guys, and then uh, today we, we practiced uh, at an off-campus site, um, had a good meal with the team, and now we're here having a little shoot around this evening here at Boardwalk Hall. We're going to walk through some things and get ourselves ready for a 9 o'clock tip tomorrow night. Early thoughts on Richmond. What are you guys working on most? Well, uh, you know, they're a very, very good team, an NCAA tournament lock right now that uh, runs an unbelievable Princeton-style offense, but they play a little bit faster. So they'll push the ball and uh, look for a very opportunistic group with some older guys. And so we're going to try to just make the game hard on them and uh, play UMass basketball. Thanks, Coach. All right, thank you. Check back here on UMass Athletics. Throughout the day tomorrow, we'll have all the results, all the information you need from Boardwalk Hall and the Atlantic 10 Tournament.